What's up, man? <laughs> What's up, Jay? <laughs> what you gonna tackle me doing? What's up, man? I miss you. <laughs> he missed you. Too. I know. How you feeling? You good? You good? What you gonna hold me so I can't leave no more? I miss you, man. You know I got a show here today. <laughs> My dad had another lady pregnant at the same time that my mom was pregnant. So in my eyes, I had a twin brother, born months apart, like a few months apart. So we were really close and things like that. Um, oh my God, I don't like to talk about this. It's okay, take your time. <laughs> I said I wasn't gonna cry. On Thanksgiving in 2018, he was in a really bad car accident. I just remember waking up in just complete distress. I just saw like 50 missed calls from my dad, 50 missed calls from my uncle, and I just knew that something like really bad had happened. Um, I just had the news that my brother was in a car accident and that he was unresponsive. Anyways, I get to the hospital and I just, I see my brother, like I said, like my twin brother, I grew up with him, we did everything together, like, and he was like my biggest motivation. I see him laying in this hospital bed, like just completely like lifeless and unresponsive. Cause at the time I didn't know if my brother was like gonna live or die. He's still here, but he's like brain dead. Really did something to me, you know? Um, and I don't like to talk about it a lot, obviously, look at me. You know I got a show tonight, Tori. You ready? I'm about to show out. I wish you could come, man. I know he'll love to be there. I know. Just seeing him like in this condition, like it completely, like completely f***ed me up. Um, I don't think I've been the same since, honestly. Through like out my music journey, throughout like all the hardships, even with my mom, like everything that I went through in my life, like he was always there, like through everything. Like he was just like, I don't know, my little number one fan. It's really hard without him. Like I said, this happened in the middle of me. Like I just signed a big deal. I had a big record going, and it was just so much pressure on me from like the label, from my team, from everything, and I just literally like, I couldn't, I couldn't do it. Yeah, I think that that is like my biggest reason in music, um, because I, I just made a promise to him that I was gonna be somebody. Even when he was like up and alive and well, like I just always told him, I was like, we gonna, we gonna be good, like we're gonna be somebody. He always told me, he said, you ain't a rapper until you get a face tat. So I remember when he was in this unresponsive state, I went to go get this face tat and I got us tatted right here to like try to wake him up or whatever. So you're doing it for your brother? 100%. There's even times where like, I just feel like I can't, like I can't, I can't, I can't. And I just always just hear his voice like, nah, like you got to. So 